end of the month, like, let's say you went for 15 minutes, but they charge you for 25. Like, do you keep track? Do you keep a record of how long you stayed on? You can, you can see that. You can see what you spend. Right, but... Is you... it like the Bunny Ranch where you set the price ahead of time so you know how long you had? No. Well. No? Yeah, you say, I don't want to go over 40 minutes. I, I want a flat rate. <laughs> yeah. I think we know each other well enough for a flat rate. <laughs> uh, we've been together now for six years. No shot of getting any of these girls to go out with you on a real date, though, right? That just doesn't go down. Uh, no, I mean, a lot of these, they don't even live anywhere near Right, here. God knows where they are. And you take them in a private room, their lips are moving, and, the, and you can hear their voice. Yeah. So, so it's not like move. some sort of scam where it's already pre -recorded. No, no, no. They, no. they call you whatever your name is and all that. Right. Uh, now, I mean, you... unless you go, unless you, like, look at uh, someone in uh, Europe or whatever. Right. What that that mean? I mean, they just, the, the... It doesn't match? Yeah, I, sometimes. Right. The, the sink is off. Yes. Does uh, he's not in a group? He's no, alone. no. You're in a group to start with, and then right, then you yes. take a girl into a private room. <laughs> yes, that's the way it's been described to me. Yes, and you're saying sometimes you end up with Europe or whatever. No, I mean it's. It Have just... you ever had someone from Africa? There's girls from Africa on there. Wow. So he's having sex around the world. Yeah, mm. spreading your seeds. So International J D. <laughs> Is that your name, International J D? <laughs> Hello, Padma. <laughs> Is there, ever, is there ever a language Please. problem? Like, where the other girl's like... Yeah, that's why I don't talk to any of the, the foreign girls. Do, do I don't understand English too good. <laughs> <laughs> thank you, Indira. <laughs> <laughs> do you thank them afterwards, or you just get off the line? Uh, I mean, I'll thank them, yeah. Like, you, do you stay... On, after you come, how long do you stay on? I'm not that long. I'm not... I'm not Cause, yeah, because you're like, hey, fuck this. Do you let the girls know they've been successful? <sighs> You did a very good job. <laughs> I hit the dot on your head. <laughs> <laughs> do, you sh do you tell them when you're coming? I don't know. No, no. No. I'm too busy. <laughs> right. Can't talk. You got any, you got any stroking lo lotion or you just don't even need that? <laughs> no. Yeah, you're a young guy. What's the preparation? I mean, do you set yourself up? Yeah, you got oh tissues. Do you have a box? Of <laughs> Be quiet. Stop. That's I don't, don't want to talk about this anymore. I dial with my pants down. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, are you nude when you call in? No. But did you just have your pants down and your underpants? I have a Playboy robe. Yeah. <laughs> you have a special robe? Oh, I have a special yeah. robe for that. Yeah. And a glove. Yeah, well, like when I beat off, I, you know, I have a whole routine. I know Richard used to talk about a whole setup. Yeah, he had a whole setup with his hard drive and a glass of wine. <laughs> yeah. You never use lotion? I would. And that get, gets it over quicker and less money. <laughs> yeah, I'm just thinking of the dollar signs here. <laughs> you know, so money. is it spur of the moment with him, or does he plan it? <laughs> Uh, it's very spurred of all that. You don't keep it. tissues by your computer for that? No. What do you come into? Uh, I just, what are, it's like the... <laughs> what, your underpants? No, no, no. I, there's like shirts that I don't even wear anymore. A shirt? <laughs> Why ruin a shirt? Because I, I can't fit into them anymore. <laughs> so you have a special cum shirt? I, 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 sometimes, yeah. Wow, I never heard of that. That's weird. Oh, my God. To me. I, okay, I, I want to go now. So bad, please. Where the, are you going? Uh, going to do something and not talk about this anymore. About the cum shirt? <laughs> no. Where do, you, where do you put that after? In yeah, the trash. Oh, I put throw, it in my oh. cum hamper. <laughs> you have a cum what? I have a There's cum paper hamper. towels, too. Oh, cum hamper. Cum hamper. Okay. Wait, Cloudy is the quicker picker-upper. <laughs> Good Lord. But you got a roommate, so how do you, you have to wait for him to leave, too, right? Uh, he hasn't. He's uh, been working out of uh, out of state for a little while. He's working out of state? Yes. He knows you're jerking off on your computer. <laughs> yeah. Get out of the country. Oh, he so you've had your own place. Nice <laughs> deal, bro. You have the place to yourself. I yeah, I mean, you get someone splitting your rent, but you get the place to yourself. Casa de Harm. Casa de Harm, are mm. No. I, I always wondered why you took so many T-shirts from that free T-shirt box. <laughs> now I know what you're doing. This is for Tuesday. This well, why come into a T-shirt? Like, why not just tissues? You don't well, have tissues. I, I don't. I never. You never have buy tissues. tissues. What about toilet paper? Well, I, I have had that uh, paper towels. So as soon as a T-shirt doesn't fit you, you put that in the area where you're going to come into <laughs> I it. I know. There's no. Uh, no, I just see whatever's laying around. Right. Yeah, I'll blow my load into this thing here. <sighs>
Uh, what is this? Ah, it's my roommate's pants. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> Here's my shoe. Oh, dear. <laughs> oh, I'm oh. fucking a penny loafer. <laughs> I'll tell you what, none of this sounds that weird to me, except for coming into your shirt. Uh, I, it, it happens sometimes. I, you know, I don't know. What You're saying it? as soon as you come into a shirt, you throw in the garbage, you ever keep it laying around and come into it a second time? No. <laughs> like you're saying, no? <laughs> See, that might be a psychological thing. You need to come into a shirt. Why? <laughs> well, because I don't know. Maybe There's nothing psychological. That. That's not it's, starch it's in just, my shirt. It's it, whatever. Mm -hmm. it, I don't know. You got to. You can't just grab whatever. You've got to make a decision right at that moment. Like, oh shit, this is a shirt I don't want anymore. Yeah. And how many times a week are you blowing a load into a shirt? How many shirts? I, can know, you I have? don't know. I don't know. I, uh, but how many shirts can you have? I. Uh, you have a ton of them. No. So no, what happens I, when you run out of shirts? I. I, it's, I. I mean, how many? How many shirts can you? I have? said. I. There's paper towels and toilet paper. I just don't oh. use tissues. Oh. Okay. All right. Uh, God. You don't give your old shirts to Goodwill, do you? No. Oh, jeez. <laughs> homeless, homeless guy running around a big load on his shirt. Hey, I, hey, that's one of my shorts, homeless gentleman. You've never accidentally worn a shirt to work that you came on, did you? No. Because I thought one time I thought I saw it. All right. <laughs> All right. You know, there's a bunch of homeless pregnant women. They, they He gave away his shirts accidentally. <laughs> Ah, uh, big deal. <laughs> yeah? You need a real girl. When's the last time you had a real woman? Uh, like last summer, I oh, think. Oh, that, that, uh, that stripper chick? No, 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 no. No. Shit, it's been a while, huh? You're a good catch, I'm telling you. You work hard. I think you, you're, you're reasonably good looking. <laughs> I do. I don't, I've seen I a lot of weirder looking guys than you. I, listen, I, I think, I, I I think don't you're better go looking out, than me. I don't go out all that much, so I'm yeah. sure it has a lot to do with it. You know what? A psychiatrist would say, stop jerking off on the computer. I know. And then that'll force you to get out. Uh, uh, you know I, what I mean? No, yeah, I know. I know a chick who went to a psychiatrist because she wasn't meeting anyone. And the guy said, how often are you masturbating? And she was like, you know, like three times a week with a vibrator and the whole, she had the whole setup. <clears throat> and the guy said to her, no more masturbation. Because what you're doing is you're withdrawing. You've got to get out there. In fact, talk to Richard. Richard broke the masturbation this pattern. Day. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, he's married now. Yeah. What about not jerking off for a while and seeing if you don't get out there and meet some girls? Uh, I'll try. I, right. You know. How long do you think you could last? I don't know. I'll find out. I guess. <laughs> Give it he's a shot. gonna try it. That's good. You might be getting what they call desensitized. Like, then when you're around chicks, all of a sudden you go, "Hey, hey." hey uh, Hey, well, let's go back to my place and put nipple clamps on, and I'll come into my shirt. I'm not that. <clears throat> I'm not that bad. No, I know, but I'm just saying you might expect it. You become desensitized. At dinner, could you suck on a dildo? Mm. <laughs> I wonder what that sucking on the dildo thing is. I'm sure he's imagining. That's your cock. <laughs> yeah. Good luck. Good luck with that. Those dildos are awfully big. <laughs> you gotta be careful too. How do you know they're not? Oh, well, they can't see you. So I, I was thinking maybe they were taping you or something. Uh, yeah. Oh, they're yeah. taping you. No, 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 no. I know. I'm not. The, this, I mean, you can't. They can't see me. All right, but they hear your voice. <laughs> no, no. You're typing? You're typing? <laughs> oh, oh, my goodness. So what do you do? You type with one hand and jerk off with the other? <laughs> no, you can stop for a second. You stop a for a second. second. <laughs> and you're like, oh, I got to Like, So when you're typing, do you ever else. type like, oh, like, you know, the sound of coming? No. No. I did that. I did online... Um, Computer sex. Uh huh. And you type uh, yeah, your like, oh, oohs and ahs. Yeah, ah. <laughs> I did. Ow, 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 ow. <laughs> He's good on that computer. I'll give that boy credit. So, what do you type? I just type whatever. I don't know. Whatever, whatever you write. Whatever. Yes, whatever. whatever. <laughs> oh, no, you get on. You say what? I, I don't know. Just whatever. It happens. No. Uh, no... He said he doesn't want to talk about it. I guess. You're kind of emasculating him right now. I'm sorry, J.D. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Please uh, forgive me. Hey, dude, I'm not saying I'm any better. I've jerked off every time possible, it's just, man. You know, What's the big it's deal? exposing something to, like, a, a lot of people, nah, and then, then so I get what? to fucking so, hear the bullshit from them and my family, for Christ's sake. <laughs> do you tell the girl you're coming in your shirt? 
Like, does that no, like, oh, no, oh, no, oh, no. I need a it's shirt. Not that, <laughs> not that uh, you know. Detail. I gacked on my Gap shirt. Yeah. <laughs> I can't believe he wastes a T-shirt with that, but I've never been that loose where I, I grab a shirt. I can't believe the T-shirt is lying around, hmm. just lying there. You ever, like, forget everything and then just come into your hand or come on your leg? No. No. You're, you're prepared. <laughs> you get something. Uh, yes. Good for you. <laughs> All right. I'm proud of you. All right. You revealed yourself, and I'm proud of you. I would like to know your online name. There's, there's nothing to know. All right. Nothing to know. <laughs> All right. I can see you're embarrassed. I won't bring you oh, up. Oh, yeah. There. Hey, you're bumming oh. me out, man. I told well, sorry. Gonna... I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> You've told me very little, really. No, okay. <laughs> From what I gather, you're paying $7 sometimes no, up to $7 no. a minute, which I don't like you doing in terms of your paycheck. Yeah, I know. And then you're you're <laughs> online and you're typing, and they're doing things, sucking on dildos, and then all of a sudden you grab your T-shirt, which I provide to you if gratis. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you appreciated that shirt. <laughs> <laughs> but, well, you've gotten a little bit heavier, so you probably a lot of your T-shirts don't fit. So, <laughs> right? Uh, yeah. Right. All right. <laughs> Serious subscribers, this is where your money goes. <laughs> Indirectly, when you pay for a subscription. Barely. <laughs> Barely is right. But. What is the monthly? The subscription, $14. No, $13, I think, or 14 I don't know, a month. Yeah, so it's like two, what is it, $7 a minute? That's right. That's two minutes for <laughs> Jake. <laughs> I'll save you, you know, if you add up the $100 or so a month or maybe more that you spend, and you just put that into some safe investment. Uh, I, You'd have a retirement fund, my friend. I'm not kidding. Think I know, I know. I, I, I know. My dad used to say stuff like that to me. He goes, you know, I'm, he goes, I never was a wealthy man. I never had a lot of income. He said, but I would take whatever I had. If it was $10. He would always say. He'd try, he'd buy a stock, he'd do something. So I'm just saying, if you well, can I, break yourself of this and just jerk off for free, like I do. I, you know. I don't want to jerk off anymore now. Good. I don't want you wasting your money jerking off. Yeah, you're going to try this abstinence thing and yeah. get out there go and out and meet a girl, right? right. <laughs> sure. Then you'll really waste a lot of money. <laughs> <laughs> but you know the, the savings that you could have. Like he, he once blew a fortune on lap dances. I, I blew my stack on him. <laughs> that was a bad night. <laughs> yeah. He blew his whole bonus. I think it was his tax return. A tax return, all right. There's a lot going on that. <laughs> no, well, whatever. It got you nowhere. Well, no, I know. I was just very drunk and uh, very. Uh, I can't think of the word. Oh well, then that brings up another Vul vulnerable. Question. What's it like not to finish any sentence? <laughs> <laughs> it's tough when you're on the radio sometimes. Right. right. <laughs> that brings up another question, though. If oh, we no. say to not JD, more. stop masturbating and get out there, is he going to get out to a strip club? No. Yeah, I can't have that. Even. No, I, I rarely go to strip clubs anymore. He needs to meet a girl already and, you know, settle down like the rest of these fuckers. <laughs> Look at this. Jason's got a wife. Will's got a wife and a kid. That's right. And when Richard, they started out, they were all yeah. single. Richard's got a wife. Everyone's taken care of at this point. Uh, I mean, I, listen, I'm not, it's not like I, I'm totally not putting myself out there. Uh, I, I talk to people here and there and stuff, and... Uh, there's a lot yeah, of listen, there were I there were a couple uh girls this past year and they you know just didn't they just lost interest. You know, there's a lot of guys who work here are ten times grosser than you. <laughs> and they've got girls. Yeah. Okay. I know. The girls lost interest in you. You were interested. Yeah. It's long stories. I mean Scott the engineer has a wife. <laughs> I mean, come on. I mean Swinging Scott the Engineer? Well, Fred has a wife. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I mean, Fred was like you. He wouldn't even leave that apartment. And he he uh, he branched out and got himself a wife. Absolutely. You want to try dial a date again with a no, real girl? No, 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 no. What? what happened no. with his dial a date? Fred what? married her. No, not Fred's. Oh. JD. <laughs> oh, JD. Oh, it was horrible. <laughs> <laughs> was it was horrible. Those blind dates. <laughs> you want to watch me jerk off into my, my towel? <laughs> You ever jerk off into a towel? <laughs> uh, maybe. Yeah. I probably have. I don't know. Some of the guy with so little to be wasting a shirt. Yeah. <laughs>
<laughs> he was on his dial a date, and uh, the girl found his shirt pile. Put <laughs> oh. that down. <laughs> You'll get pregnant. Oh. <laughs> wow. Why don't I fix you up on a dial a date again? We'll try. Want to do it? Uh, you looking for a date? I'll help you. No, you know I, I love you. No, I know. I, uh, I'm. What? I, I don't know. I'd have to think about it a little bit. What's going on? What? He doesn't want a date. He wants a fuck. No, no, he, I'm talking about a relationship. I don't think he wants one. You don't want one, really? Is Gary right? I, I, listen, there's both pros and cons, and I'm, I'm not necessarily focused on relationships right now. Wow. But... All right, so you're not lonely. What are you focused on? He's nothing. Oh, uh, I, you know, I do get lonely sometimes, but then, you know, it's, those times are less than the times that I'm not lonely. Is but what someone... are you focused on? Are you focused on career? <laughs> yeah, try I, or, or just or just or just thinking about it and stuff. And he's focused on coming in shirts. <laughs> he's focused on his career. He's always talking to you and direct a movie. I haven't yeah, seen. Yeah, all right. He never goes over to Howard TV and says, "Let me direct something." <laughs> I, I've offered. I, that know, to him. I, I know. I told him. I said, "Go to Howard TV and direct a yes. little feature. Do a five-minute feature." No, no, no. Can't do that. He's busy. <laughs> I never said I was busy. I'm busy jerking off no. of my shirt. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, if anyone in our audience has old shirts they don't need, can you send them to JD? The JD shirt drive. That's all I fucking need now. Like, oh, JD, he's gonna be inundated. The JD shirt drive. The JD shirt drive. Uh, <laughs> please make sure they are laundered. Why don't I set you up? Is there anyone in the company you're interested in? You want maybe Lisa G or someone like that? I can <laughs> no. see you two. No? You don't think no. that's a match? No. All right. All right. So you're not into a relationship. I thought maybe you were hungering for uh, intimacy. I, I, I mean, if it happens, it happens, but not, I'm not... You're not in any rush. Seeking it. No. Yeah. Yeah, I guess I hardly know ye. <laughs> I guess I hardly know ye. I thought you were lonely and wanted a relationship, but I'm wrong. <laughs> in other words, people are a burden to you. Right. I, I, I don't know. know if it's like that. Right. <laughs> but you don't want to be bothered with other people's uh, issues. It's either that or I don't want to, my me to be bothering, bothering other people. Right. What is his social life? Does he go out? I'm with... thinking of girls. Rarely. I'm thinking of girls. He hardly leaves his apartment except yeah. to come to work. I'm thinking of a girl. What about Alexis Stewart for you? You know which one that is? That's Martha Stewart's daughter. I mean, she's got a kid, but... She's a good catch. That's a catch. She doesn't work. Uh, so, uh, something tells me I'm not... She's not exactly interested in someone like me. Well, I don't know about that. Oh, okay. I don't see her with anyone. Uh, I'm friends with Jenny Hutt, too. That would, that would not go well. No. well. <laughs> Any of the girls on the Playboy channel you want? <laughs> I, 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 they I, have to go out with you. I can force them. No. <laughs> All right, J.D., listen... If you ever feel like telling me your name, I'd appreciate it. <laughs> yeah. All right. I'll leave it there up There will be you. no name now anymore anyway. So. Right. You really going to give up masturbating on these sites? I'm glad because take that money and put it aside. Uh, after yesterday, this, and now having it bring, brought up again today, and, and this uh, whole thing. My prediction, to this afternoon you'll be doing it. <laughs> no, I'll probably be asleep this afternoon. All right. Well, thank you, J.D. <laughs> thank you for your honesty. Oh, no. Thank you. All right. Thank you. Again. There he goes, J.D. Formerly the badass, no longer. Loves to jerk off on the computer. That was a segment of Meet J.D. Meet J.D. Get to know our family. <laughs> Get to know the staff. That's right. He's a good man. Uh, a